it used to be when I started my career that I would set my alarm clock, get up, write for four hours, and then take a break, have lunch, and like go to Target, you know, or something. Like that was my day. Writing four hours seemed like a good day. Now I have two kids who kind of get in the way of everything, so I just write as much as I can whenever I can. I've lately started writing by hand, which has been helping me tremendously. Um, so that's sort of the new thing. Um, my husband, who's very sweet and always very supportive, sent me away to a hotel the other night for 48 hours of silence so that I did nothing but work and read. Um, and my advice for young writers, is, there's sort of like three things. One is read. Read as much as you can and read the best stuff you can. The second thing is um, to get off your phone and get off like any kind of tablet or, you know, to pay attention in the world. Like sit on a train and try to not do anything. Try not to read, try not to get on your phone, just watch the world and observe. Um, and my third piece of writing, this is for young writers and I see students come in a lot of times and ask me how they can get published. And my third piece of advice is to stop thinking about getting published. Um, which sounds so counterintuitive, but it's really, it's really like, just make your work the best it can be. By the time your work is really strong, I mean, it will get public. You know, like the right things will happen for it, the need to happen for it. But your job is to make it as strong as it can be. Your job is not to think about getting published necessarily. I mean, that will come when it's ready.